Me 40 female and my husband 39 male married young and were each other's first. We have been married for nearly 18 years. We have two children 19 female, 18 male and both of them have moved out and are living their life. Due to COVID, I lost my job in February and got a new one in August. During this time, my husband had to do more work so that his job must be secured. So he was more distant due to his job. In my new job, I developed a crush on one of the young guy 25 male and started feeling excited. Nothing was wrong in our marriage and I still don't know why I had those feelings for that guy. I might be insecure in myself. I started arguing with my husband for no reason and blamed him for everything wrong. At that time, I thought of everything possible to be upset with my husband. As in our country, restrictions on COVID were removed in late August, so I started going out with my friends. I also started flirting with the young boy. In early September, I suggested open marriage to spice up our relationship. I told him that I wanted to have fun and suggested him to do the same. I told him that our 20 seconds and 30 seconds went by just looking upon kids and now we should enjoy ourselves. He was completely against it. He said that marriage is not a joke and is special bond between two. At that time, I was having different mindset and told him how he had to change with new lifestyle and how old-fashioned he is. He was still against it, so I started manipulating him and threatened to divorce. He finally agreed to open our relationship. For first month, I hooked up with that guy and had several one-night stands. My husband also started started dating but never slept with anyone. In October, I started realizing that most men never took care of my needs and pleasure. My husband was the only one who took care of my needs. The idea of sleeping with other men was short-lived and I stopped it. I started having sex with my husband again and felt great. We were still dating other people. He was dating his high school friend and also had several sexual encounters with her after a month of dating. I started feeling jealous because of him dating her and still sleeping with her. In mid-November, I suggested to once again close our marriage and be monogamous. He was adamant that he would not do it. We had lots of fight. We argued a lot but he didn't change his decision. He was still going over to her house and spending nights over there. This situation was like a torture to me. I had to spend night alone in our marital home, on our marital bed knowing that he was with other women and was entertaining her. On the 28th of November, I tried to commit suicide because the emotional trauma was exceeding its limits. I was rushed to hospital by my my husband and this led to change him his decision. He now agreed to close our marriage again. I was a bit relieved. I thought we would recover pretty quickly from this phase of life. But hell I was wrong. He still thought about her. He even bought her a gift for her birthday. He wanted to go to her house to give her the present. But I agreed to let him go to her house on the condition that I would be going with him. We arrived at her house. Her house was pretty big and looked really expensive. We arrived at the door and she opened the gate. She took the gift and gave a hug to my husband in front of me. I got pissed and wanted to leave. She invited us for drinks but I refused and we came back home. Last night, when we were having sex and he was just about to climax, he finished off while saying her name. I was pissed about it. I felt humiliated and was angry that he was thinking about her during sex also. He was also sorry for this but said that he is still confused regarding her. He ended up sleeping on couch. This morning, he said that he cannot live like this. He wanted some space from me and that he would be moving out for some days to clear his mind. I agreed to it because I had no other option. In afternoon, my friend sent me a pic of him at her house. She lives nearby and saw him at her door. I was devastated and called him. He answered and told me that we were on break so we could see other people. It's been five hours and I am a wreck right now. He is not able to forget her and it's ruining our relationship. I know that I already destroyed most of the marriage but now I am going to do anything to fix it. I have written everything on basically so that you can give me some advice. I literally don't know what I am writing and seeking from writing here but I cannot share this with our children. I have realized how much he loved me unconditionally and I don't want to throw away our 20 years together. Any advice on how to make him change his decision? I have 38 female hurt my husband 40 male by telling him I've never really found him attractive, physically desirable. So I feel horrible. A few months ago I confessed to my husband of 14ers that a while back I had a strong, crush, sexual desire for a man that we both know. Now it was nothing more than a crush and it passed quickly, but the feelings were strong and I had never felt like that before. My husband wasn't so upset that I experienced attraction towards someone else, it was that I had never had it for anyone else including him. This led to a lot of conversations about our past and all it's done is make everything horrible. He basically has figured out through repeated conversations, integrations that not only did I never have. That lovestruck feeling for him something I have only had recently with the other man and honestly didn't believe I would ever have but I never really found him remotely handsome. And this attraction issue was a big part of the reason I dragged my feet in finally marrying him. He feels extremely rejected and hurt and basically feels I lied to him. Early on in our relationship he asked about attraction and I would basically play it off as I never really felt attraction to any guy's eye. Didn't want to hurt him, but I probably should have been honest then instead of now and wouldn't be in. This mess, we started as friends in college and over time grew to spend a lot of time together. Even though my attraction wasn't there I loved other things about him, he is smart, kind, caring, confident, 
and funny. We overall have a good marriage, three kids, shared values, we enjoy spending time together, he is a great provider and father, and our sex life is good, he is a very generous love, and always makes me feel beautiful even after all these years and three kids. And now I have ruined it, his confidence is gone. He has said he was more understanding of our early relationship lacking PDA, early relationship lovey. Devi stuff with the understanding that I just didn't feel, act that way about guys in general, but knowing that I'm not and was not really physically attracted to him makes him feel like crap and trapped in our marriage. I have broken his heart. He deserves to have a wife that lifts him up and feel like the man he is. What can I do? I want to have those feelings for him and make him believe it. I try being extra affectionate and it goes well for a bit. But then he feels like I'm just faking it and goes back to being distant. How can I make him feel better? How can I drive myself to have a physical attraction he isn't repulsive? Just the feelings never developed. I'm terrified he will leave me I can't blame him or seek out some physical attention somewhere else. 